starting at the center parting, create a section below the crown running diagonally to above the ear. Repeat the section symmetrically on the second side. Create a symmetrical horizontal section at the nape. Define the horizontal guideline below the comb. Use the fine side of the comb for more control. Check the balance. Continue to work with parallel sections towards the top of the head until the entire area has been cut. Bring down the two front sections. Neatly define the diagonal guideline parallel to the hairline on both sides. Comb the section on the first side neatly inwards over the nose and cut a diagonal shape from long to short. Hold the first section as flat as possible against the head for minimum elevation. Overdirect the section slightly inwards at the ear to create as much length as possible on the sides. Check the shape. Overdirect the section on the second side in the opposite direction, keeping it as flat as possible against the nose, and cut the guideline. Use the shortest point of the previously cut side as a guide. Continue to work with another parallel section on both sides. For the second section, slightly increase the elevation but keep the sectioning and over-directing the same. Continue with the third section. Increase the elevation again, now to nearly 90 degrees. Check the shape and balance. Create a vertical section across the center parting. Define the guideline on the top of the head. Overdirect the section slightly forward and use the section cut in step 3 as a guide. Cut a rising line from short to long. Continue to work with sections parallel to the first side. Overdirect each section to the previously cut section. Continue with this technique until you reach the parietal ridge. Do not cut the area below. Check the shape and movement. Continue to use this technique on the second side. Check the balance. Use the cross-check technique to check the top area. Visually adapt the unconnected sides above the ear from step 4 with the tips of the scissors to suit the shape. If necessary, the internal shape at the nape and the back of the head can be incorporated into the cut using a freehand technique. Moisten the hair with Essentiel Classic Conditioning Spray and comb it through with the wide toothed comb. Use a product cocktail with equal parts of La Biosthetic Curl Defining Styling Fluid and Curl Control Mousse. Evenly work the product cocktail into the hair over the lengths and tips and shape the hair as desired. Comb the hair through again. Dry the hair with the diffuser, carefully moving the hair while drying it. 
Use a small amount of La Biosthetique Curl Defining Styling Fluid as a finishing product. Beauty begins the moment you decide to be yourself. Self-love is a superpower.